hello students so welcome to the channel so today in this video we are going to discuss the synthesis of diphenylhydramine it is also known as benadryl or bendilate and it is an h1 antagonist so let's discuss about this synthesis of diphenylhydramine first of all take diphenylmethane And in the presence of Br2 and light, so there will be the addition of Br and the next structure. Here we get the addition of Br in the structure. So, next step is So with these two structures, we get the final product in the presence of heat plus K2CO3. The product is formed that is diphenylhydramine. structure is formed is a structure that is in this we just remove the bromine atom and through this bromine atom we just get the removal of HBr on the formation of diphenylhydramine so this oxygen attach with this carbon and we get the final product what is its name its name is diphenylhydramine And was it, what is its uh, IUPAC naming? Its name is 2 benzyl hydroxy nn dimethyl ethanamine. So now we will discuss its properties. Soluble in water and in alcohol.
Now we will discuss its activity and its uses. It shows antiemetic, antitussive, and sedative property as well as with antihistaminic property. Now we will discuss about its dose. The usual dose is 25 to 50 mg for adult. So students this is all about this video I hope you like the video so please subscribe and hit the bell icon for getting more updates thanks for watching